What's up everybody, my name is Arctix and I know it's been a while. I'm back with another update for Midnight Society. If you guys remember, a little over a year ago, way back when all of this first started, we had an ARG that the team put together for us to try and figure out. We would meet up in the Discord at around midnight on the Pacific Standard Time, which was 3 a.m. my time, and we'd get together with the community, those of us that were part of the Day Zero community, and we'd try to solve whatever puzzles and crazy riddles that the team came up with for this ARG. Now we ended up solving the whole thing. It gave us something called an airdrop. And at the time we didn't know what that airdrop was, which we later found out was an actual founder's pass. That meant we had a free founder's pass that we didn't have to pay for, which is awesome. That means we got into the program. We had a founder's pass fully paid for. We didn't have to do anything but spawn an email. Fast forward to now and Midnight Society has come out with a second ARG. This one's a little bit different and it all started on Twitter. Mr. Spaceman, a Midnight Society community member who often delves deep into lore, happened to tweet out to Rob Bowling and Midnight Society asking, where is Space Bob? Because at the end of the last variant guidebook, Space Bob was teased, which is usually where there's clues for the next snapshot. The next snapshot is here and Space Bob is nowhere to be found. Rob did reply with a video of his own and some subtext that basically says Space Bob with the no sign, meaning there is no Space Bob, but it had a video attached. That video was extremely cryptic and and directed specifically at Mr. Spaceman. We've seen this encryption before in the first ARG. We know it as the variant encryption code. Now the Conspiracy Theory Clues channel in the Discord wasted no time and got to work. Spaceman, stop searching. I think we're being... <laughs> What happened to my video?